Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Portal Knights. Alright, last time we came to this desert world. Activated the portal, but we didn't go inside. And last episode I said, I was like, why can't I not stay in first person mode? Well, I figured that out. It was in the options. <clears throat> you go down to settings. Customize controls. I don't know if it was actually in here. Gameplay, yeah, here it is. It says th Force Third Person Combat. It was activated. I turned it off. So I could stay in first person mode while fighting and dodging. I played this a little bit off camera. So I can do it, get a few levels in and I've mined a little bit more copper. I should be at level 7 right now. Might just turn level 8 actually. Let's see here. <clears throat> yep, level 7. Alright, I got 3 points to spend. I want a little bit more damage. Just give me a little bit of health. And I get, I put like 2 points in agility. So. Alright. We got one more place to explore here before we move on to the next world. You see where that guy is over there? He has a quest for us. Apparently there's a mine over there. I need to get some scales and I think that's later on. <clears throat> In a different world. It's pretty easy to dodge when you're in first person like this and just aim at something. Start shooting them and then can dodge using space bar. So I usually push le uh, A or D key. And just dodge right before they hit me so they don't get any hits in. Repair my stuff. Alright, let's move on to this mine over here. While I was off camera, I noticed it was a mine. I was like, what? There's a mine over here? I didn't even notice that last time. Well, it gives us more to explore. Yep, right here. It's kind of hard to see from the backside. And you, and you spawn in over there. So it just looks like a mountain. I don't think I even came over here. <laughs> Alright, what you want, Stanton? The geologist. An adventurous person like you, you surely wouldn't mind helping me out a little. I'd like to examine a sample of the local flame ruby. Would you bring me some for my studies? <clears throat> what if I want the flame ruby? My thanks for retrieving those samples, uh, these samples for me, since I already had some in my inventory. My work is vital if we're to regain the knowledge lost to the tragi tragedy. Tragedy. What kind of what kind of stuff is spewing from my mouth right now? tragedy of our recent history plus this place is spooky at night well yeah it's a mine i think it's spooky at day too perfect here my grant money allows me to give you this for your trouble <clears throat> good amount of exp if i could earn this in like five enemies 24 gold is that all i got you took 10 of you should only take like two <clears throat> Don't know if that was really worth it. <clears throat> oh, right here. Oh, maggots. We got maggots. Ow. Oh, I got a football. What is it you want, kid? I want a Red Rider BB gun with a compass in the stock. No, you'll shoot your eye out, kid. How about a football? Yes, yeah, a football. Can you name me uh, name that movie? All right. See these guys are here. If you kill them, if they don't blow up on you, they drop coal. They take a couple of hits. They're not too difficult, but they do drop coal. Not very much. Go down, man. You skelly. Nobody wants you, skelly. <clears throat> how much? How much copper do I have upon my my person? I got over 121. Oh yeah. And I got like a few coal. Nothing too great. But that quote I said was from a movie called The Christmas Story. Or A Christmas Story. <clears throat> eh, classic movie from the 80s. Here's a chest. This was a pretty small mine. In my opinion. Do I even have any fire rubies left? Yeah, I got a bunch. Never mind. Loot. Let it rain. Let it rain. 
All right. I'd love to have a copper bow right now. <clears throat> but I need scales. I'm going to have to move on to a different world for scales. Well, I think I might be done here for the most part. Shoot them enough, they start running away. But that's the only enemies that do that that I know of. The rest of them don't run away from you, they just keep on attacking. <laughs> I sound a little better today than I did yesterday. I, I'm still sick though. Feel like I'm always holding back coughing. You know how if you're, uh, when you try to hold back a cough and your throat's all itchy and you just, it's hard to? Well, that's how I feel this whole time. <clears throat> but I'm trying. I'm trying to be more energetic in this video. More happy and more energetic and not like lethargic. Alright. Still mining that copper. The grind continues. You know what I was thinking about? So I'm a big fan of the Game Grumps and certain groups like that on YouTube. I need I need a partner. Like the Game Grumps. They have two people that make jokes and crack jokes together and doing all their videos and stuff. That's what I need. I'm doing this all solo. I'm alone, guys. I'm alone. I got no friends. What is those? Mini bombs. Mini bombs. I need to save these water bombs that's in my hot bar right now. Might use these mini bombs though. I got nine of them. It's on six. Can I actually switch to it? Let's try them out real fast before we move on. I don't think I ever used a mini bomb before. Even on the PS4 edition of this game. <clears throat> Oh, poison? Did he even do it? Yeah, it did something to him. Wasn't great though. Ah, I ran right into him. Say the object of dodging is not do that. I literally ran right into him twice. See, I'm doing that on purpose. I'm showing you guys how not to do it. <laughs> like you all gonna believe me, right? You're like, ha! I failed. That's what it was. Alright, I think we're ready to go to the portal now. Let's move on. Let me get some of that coal. I'm worried about this block right here. I'm <clears throat> what is this? I gotta check this out real fast. There might be something underneath it. Uh, no, there wasn't. I already checked it. It just looks funny. Looks funny like I do. I'm funny looking. Alright. Fort Finch. Our, our first actual town. The Squires Knoll is not really a town. It's like one building and a mine. And a landing pad. Now I think this place always has coal. Yep, I already see it right now. And I still got my bee hood. Can't go without the bee hood until I find something cooler. Developers can give me more stuff, right? Ah, welcome to the fort. Welcome to the fart. Fart made of stone. Alright. Yes, I said fart, not fort. Completely different. Now we're going to mine up some of this coal so we can start making bars. Straight bars. That sounded so cheesy. But I'm a, I'm a YouTuber. Everything we say is cheesy. <laughs> ah, the truth. The truth shall set me free. Man, I need a better pick. This one is so slow. It's like molasses in January. Yeah, I like banging out of stone for like 15 minutes. <laughs> the fun. So fun. Alright, how much coal do I have in total? I got 28. That might be enough to get some... Some stuff done here. Let's go back. Oh, we got a, I got an event here. What do we got? Emperor's care a courier. Six days. Is that in game days or real world days? A special visitor from the distant islands has come to ask for your aid. Okay. But those those uh 
special events that happen randomly on the map. And more worlds you have unlocked, more events you'll have to appear. And some of those events are pretty pretty good, but they can be real dangerous compared to the normal enemies that you'll be fighting. That are like I've ran into one where I was like level 10 or 11. And the enemies were level 20. And it was bad. But the world had iron. So I spent like a couple hours farming iron slowly. And it was uh, painstaking, but hey, it was worth it. I was able to bail some awesome armor and weapons and things. Alright, let's see. Copper bar takes one and three. Dang, dude. Dang, what? Oh, I don't even have that stone yet. Let's make ten of them to start with. More you build, slower the bar goes. One will go like ee, two ee, slower, and then ten, slow as possible. Did something hit me? I need to build torches. It's dark and broken. My house, isn't it so lovely? It's so beautiful. Wow. Hey, blue dude. Are you part of that one band that has blue in the in the title? Oh, excuse me guys oh. the itching got too too severe couldn't hold it no longer and if you're wondering I might mute that spot but I just coughed almost couldn't control it all right yep I'll take my 10 bars let's see I got 18 left where's my bars there they are let's put them right here put the copper over here by all this stuff all right Anvil. Hey, uh, oh no, not the anvil. This. Yes. Okay, so I need scales. Scales. And that's in the next world after the fort. If I build, find the portal, then I could go uh, to the next world. And I think the enemies there will drop scales. What does my bow do? This is 14 damage. The regular cop is 25. I don't really want to waste the money on it or the uh, materials on this, but I might have to. Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and build it. Oh, Tinkerer. What? I'm a Tinkerer. Yay. Oh, I got some torches right here. What am I doing with this? What am I doing with my life? Why am I not using these things? Sorry, Windbow. You were great for a very short time. Critical strike chance, 11%. Wow, by one point, whoa. Big leaps and bounds there, guys. Oh yeah, and I got that football. And if I if I remember correctly, these footballs, uh, you can't pick them back up after you drop them. No, you can kick them around and stuff, but they're pretty much a lost cause after that. Alright, go into here. Let's go into furniture. I need a, a chest or not. Dang wood. Infinite wood problems, man. Always need that wood. I'm gonna try to take, take down the trees further from my house, not close to my house, because I like having trees around my house. Don't judge me. Why can't? Why is some of these I can't destroy? Uh oh, oh, okay. As a parrot. Remember that one berry bush? I couldn't destroy that berry bush. Well, that tree I can't destroy either. The target is red. Hey, dude. Hey, they give me a good EXP. Look at that. 160. That's some good EXPs. For this early in the game. Slimes, not so much. They're mainly there. Just get some uh, water bottles so you can make potions. Which I need to build the table for. Alright. Now, what's it going to cost me for armor? Next set. Oh, I got the Beastmaster stuff. This costs bones. Well, how many bones do I have? I got eight. Eight boners. That sounded so bad. Huh. 
Oh, I could build the... Okay, from the archer station, I can build that next set. These are all 40... These are pretty high. Let's see what the next archer set costs. Yeah, it's lower in damage and stuff and armor, but... I get double jump. One. That's four. Five. Six. Six cloth. Four copper and... I got plenty of these, so let's go ahead and build ourselves. That's that armor, if I got enough co uh, cotton. Oh, cotton. Do I got the cotton? I think it cost me six, so two, four, yeah, six. But do I have any on me at the very moment? Left over? No. Nope. One, two, three, four, five six ladies and gentlemen I can count can you believe it all right I should have everything for the armor so let's build sharpshooters cap boom why does it sound like a marble rolling around or something not right about that man sounds like one of those uh, gambling tables can't remember what it's called I don't gamble, so I don't know these things. But the one where you spin the wheel and it has that ball. I know I sound like a complete fool when I'm talking about that stuff. But I don't gamble. Come on now. Be easy on me. Backpack fool. Sharpshooter. This gives me critical strike chance. Plus three. 38 sharpshooter studded leather. It gives me health 20. Oh yeah. Hell 20 again. And double jump and critical strike chance or damage plus two. Oh man. I'm overpowered now. I gotta quit the game. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get banned for cheating. I'm over overpowered. Alright. Boom. We have light. Look! Light! Alright. I need a chest. I need some chest here, guys. I need a chest. Boom. Craft. You know what I'm gonna do? No. No, game, no. Right, go back. Bam. I'm just throwing stuff on the ground. Just throw it on the ground. I don't know where these bombs are. Those bombs are not powerful at all. They're like weak sauce. Uh, let's rotate that way. There we go. Keep it by the front door. Or well, if you can call that a front door. But in the corner. Yeah, these don't have a lot of space in them. But they will get rid of some of this stuff I do not need. No. Alright. Man, this is slow. There's no quick, no quick way to do this. No, I'm keeping that on me. Uh, hmm. Yeah, put away our poor wooden bow. Say goodbye, bow. I could sell it later. Probably do that off camera so I'm not like... Hey guys, watch me sell stuff. So much fun. So much adventure. I got a bite trap. Ah, well, that chest is full already. Yay. Come on, chest. You need to be more upgraded than that. That's weak. Let's see if I can build one more. Welcome to the crafting episode where I just stand here in front of the tables all day. Are you guys excited? So much fun in games. Alright. Bam. I have to put this stuff away. It's too much. I can't handle it. Alright, wood can stay in my inventory. This I can go for now. I need to find somewhere for these trophies, but it's all the same kind of trophies. Let's put away some of these portal stones because I have a lot on me right now. Let's go ahead and keep two stacks. Yeah, a stack is 50, as you can see. Fireball scrolls, they're not that powerful. I tried using them off camera and I'm like, wow, these are weak sauce. 
Actually, I'm going to keep these on me because you can make potions with these. I don't think you can do it on your person. You have to have it in the crafting table. Well, this is so much excitement. I'm going to get millions of views because of this awesome, awesome video. My videos are awesome. What am I talking about? I need to keep the stone on me. Alright, let's move on. I need to go get me some scales. Scale time. Alright, we're going to go back. Uh, should we do this? Yes. If I remember correctly, it opens up another town that allows you to buy armors. And in the fort, there's a person that sells islands that you can that has no monsters on it. Any islands are allow you to build what you want. But don't don't hold my word to that because I don't exactly remember. It might be further on. But where are you, dude? We are a little bit more powerful than the last time. Oh, there he is. The orange house. The warm glow of candlelight. Or torches. Oh yeah, I'm doing a little bit more damage, of course. Still not enough for my taste. I'd rather have... That masterwork. I'll get that option, though. Turtle? You guys stay immune for way too long. Hey, I dodged. I dodged. You guys saw it. Uh, it was a bit late, I guess, but... I still dodged. It's a sickness. I'm sick, so I'm like, I don't... I'm not as uh, fast. <laughs> Ooh, 82 damage. Dang, bro. Dang. I'm thinking this in-game days. Ow. Dude. That was a not a very good fireball there. But... Hey, dude, what's up? No, this ain't the same guy. Ah. Oh. This is the quest guy for the uh, event. But it's not the same guy I was thinking. Oh well. What you got, bro? Brave Knight, I come far or from islands far away to seek a hero that can help us defeat the evil that has corrupted our emperor. Destroy the small chest next to me. The item within will lead you to my islands, which are plagued by a terrible curse. If I remember correctly, these enemies are tough. Ooh, what's that? A magical dragon statue. Ooh. That'd be cool if you can actually keep this and actually, like, use it as, like, a little trophy or something. <clears throat> but I know you have to click on the item. Here's it in my hand. Then you click on it. You know, it's like a personal teleporter. It'll take you to the island at which they need help. And I remember this place, these guys were a pain in the butt. They shoot a magical, well the ones on the PS4 I ran to, they shot a magical health draining area of effect spell, then it was hard to dodge it, and it, they kept killing me over and over again. And then you have the jade dudes that are very powerful right there. Ooh, I like the way that looks back there. That's so pretty, guys. It's so pretty. Well, we were going to move to that one island, but... Oh, we got Jade here. This is Jade. Bamboo. Looks like a... Cherry Blossom, maybe? And you got these bad guys. These right here. Those are the dudes right there I'm talking about. Yep. My first death. No. Okay. Yep. Those are the dudes I was talking about. The magic they use is just like... Extreme. Wow, that just instantly killed me. Yeah, some of these uh, side missions are way tougher than the overworld side missions. There we go. It's just about timing. And I failed. Because I got stuck on something. And he died anyways. Look at that. What the, what the what? Well, I only got four potions. Eat. Alright. Eating doesn't do very much. They ain't far away. It's 
It's about when to dodge. They are dropping winter furs. Not what I need. I need scales. But this is a timed mission. That means if I don't beat it within six game days, I'll probably not get another chance at doing this mission. This place is so tough. It is so difficult. Now these dudes you have to be real careful with because they have multiple attacks that are pretty rangy and they got a lot of health. So do circle strafing, dodging, if you can. That attack right there where they slam on the ground can pretty much one shot you, especially with how much health I got right now. And it. Yeah, this place is to. Very, very tough. What sucks is that their health comes back, but mine does not. So fair. Why do I do that? It much damage all the time. There's too many bushes and trees here, that's what it is. Alright, bro. Yeah, my damage output is so bad. Wow, that really worked. Best dodging ever. Is he trying to heal? What is that move he's doing? And I rolled, but because I was firing my bow at the same time hit and roll, it didn't count. Alright. Well, this place might, I might not be able to do this place. It's a little too tough for me right now. I'd like to have that Masteric Bow. That'll do more damage. You guys should drop scales. I'll drop anything. Drop scales. I do need the winter fur though. I know that's like a pretty high up tier. I like this water. That's kind of cool. Oh, there's a portal here. Oh, no. A knight. How fortunate. Fortuitous. Blah. Perhaps you could save our emperor. I'm waiting for Kong to make one of his green fireworks fountains. Fountains. They're quite beautiful. But more importantly, we'll need them for the cleansing ceremony. I can't speak right now. <clears throat> My speaking skills have went down to nothing. I know there's a mission here for... These guys are easier to kill, but that magic they use are, is really bad. Like I can say it's a good place to level. These monsters demolished our house. My back isn't what it used to be. Could you please help us and repair it? They want me to get some bamboo, I think. Dovaki, what? Oh man, I need to blow my nose something bad right now. I know I shouldn't be saying that on camera. It sounds bad. But I do. These bombs are kind of waste. They do no damage. I may may not be able to kill stuff very easily, but doesn't mean I can raid. I cannot raid everything. And get my stuff that way. I keep pushing E. I never learn. Well, I'm in bad shape right now. Ooh. These awful bamboo or uh, a rat a rack. Tulas, Aractulas, not tarantulas, but Aractulas, invaded our garden. Can you please help us? Sure. I probably won't be able to kill them. May the great lion watch over you during this test. 
still pushing E. It's got to be a forever thing in this entire let's play. Spiders are easier to kill, but still. This tree, though. Who decided to plant this tree right here? Plant the spider. No, you don't with your, your spider webs. Well, the spiders are a lot easier than the uh, stuff on the outside. Why'd I jump up like that? I went really high. Dude. One more spider. Done. Yay, we completed something this this overpowered world. Overpowered. Alright. Thank you. Now I can start restoring our garden. This is all the EXP you gave me? Really? For that? You know how tough this place is? Alright, bamboo table, recipe for red firework. Ooh. Use. Red firecracker. Awesome. And I got points to spend. More damage. Health. Yeah. Now I'm overpowered. <clears throat> if only, right? And I failed. And I failed again. Wow, what, what, what's going on? My dodging skills has gone to nil. I don't know if I can even take anything out. That's the problem I'm having. And, yep. That magic they use is very, very cheap. It's one of the cheapest in the game. So that was too far. Hey, I dodged. Iframes! Iframes! Need those iframes! Yeah, this place is too much. It's too much. We completed one quest here, though. That is something. Man, that took me far away, too. Look at this. I'm on the other side of the world. <clears throat> We're gonna go back to Fort the Fort. Where I actually have a chance. Yeah, if I get the if I if the mission is still there and I get the masterwork bow, then I'll go back. I'll be able to do a little bit more damage. All right, we have made it to our destination. Should have made a new uh, pickaxe, didn't I? Oh well. Loot. Too far, huh? I shouldn't be killing these eyeball things because I think they are part of a quest. Can I not fast get these out? I want to be able to get them out. How do you get them out quickly? There was a way to do it on the PS4, but I don't know how to do it on here. Alright. Moving on. Gotta want to be careful here because there's a lot of pitfalls. It's scary. And all these are shops if you see a little bag. Next to their name, this means they are a shop. But you can always loot their goods too, as well. Well, I never use this classic seat. What? Already know it or something? Alright. Now, notice that if you, if you see a shelf that looks like this but has nothing in it, like nothing on the uh, shelves itself, means that the uh, it's not going to have anything on the actual. See, has nothing. <laughs> Sorry for all the the gross sounds with all the nose and stuff, sniffling and whatnot. I'm so sick. 
But I make sure to upload every day for you guys, not unless something drastic happens. And I can't. Can I search that up there? If I can even search it. Ooh. Rocket. Propel yourself into the air with a huge rocket. Okay. Alright, what you got selling? The folks here that complain, it's only because they haven't been on the outside for a while. You know the portals over there, you just kill some stuff and you got yourself some portal. So you got mannequins. Different style of mannequins, I guess. I guess you could put armor on these. Huh. Wow, that copper bow's only worth 31. That is not good. Alright. I break all your stuff. Now, you shooting lightning at me, man? What is up with that? It's too much. Oh, there's a portal right here. Any more maggots? Maggots? Yep. Ew, acid. No. Sometimes in this game, actually all the time, if you walk away from an enemy just enough, they will automatically heal back to full again. Which is kind of cheap, in my opinion. Alright. Let's build ourselves the next one. So I need six. There we go. Put these down here. Now we got the next world opened up. And this one should have the guys that drop the scales. I hope. I need the scales, man. So I'll come back here later. There's more to explore here. If you want to, if you want to, uh, want to know how many portals there is here, you go into here. It has two portals here that lead out to different new new islands, and I have one activated out of two. So there's enemies and stuff here, of course, but the, this place is mainly for selling and buying. So we'll come back and explore this later. But I'm looking for scales. We're running out of time on my video here. So let's go. We need some scales for the masterwork bow. And some other stuff later on. I think the scales are used for some armor too. I know the winter fur is used for a really high, high level weapon. But it's like way up there. Alright. More desert. We're not going to do any quests right now. Later. Level 4. It's not bad. What the? Dude. Did you die? I guess he died. I guess they're susceptible to fall damage as well. Okay. Map. Check out what's here. Okay, copper, sand block, flame rubies. Same as that last world. Oh, that other world before the last world. <clears throat> oh, look at that temple up there. Well, we're getting close to the first boss. This actually, there's a mission here to get a key that in the next world I go to from here will take me to a boss gate. That's going to be in the future episode. I'm just looking for scales right now. You ain't gonna drop any scales. Um. Oh, he drops coal too. Nice. Hmm. I don't see any other enemies besides the slimes. No. It almost threw it off the edge for me. Like, no. I want my coal. Coal useful. I wonder if there's anything underneath these uh, bits of temple. Ew. 
I barely dodged that hit. You see that? I was like barely. Now, is there anything under here like that last world? Okay, what is the, the shape of that block looks not quite right. It's like long. I don't know if there's actually anything underneath there. Might be something underneath this one though. I think I know what the, where the, I get the scales from. You have to wait until night time and the new enemies will spawn out here. And the those enemies drop the scales. Right, we're looking under here real fast just to make sure I'm not missing a loot chest. Oh, there's one of them right there. Uh, maybe not. We got these on their, uh, the squires and all. So, nope, they don't drop scales. Dang it, where do I get scales, guys? Do I have to fight the boss first? But in my, uh, on the PS4 version, I had the Masterwork Bow before I came here. So, I must have had one of those, uh, yeah, that's probably what it was. It was the, remember I said that early on, I got the, uh, the Asian style mission. Well, that's probably what it was, because in the PS4 version, I got a different mission, which led to a different world that gave me scales. So, yeah. Alright, now it makes sense. I'm not, I'm, is it okay to say Asian? On the internet? I just hopefully it's not like something bad <clears throat> not racist or anything so don't think I am but that place where all the jade was that was way too powerful for me even though I'm very overpowered right now that world's way overpowered over me Yep, we can do this portal. This leads us to the next area. So let's do that real quick while we can. Alright. Boom. Now we can move to the next area. Now I think this leads to uh, the next island that leads to the boss, or the boss gate. Alright, well we got ourselves a lot to do in the next episode. I'm out of time. Well you guys got to see a cool looking uh, bamboo forest. That place is a little over my level. But awesome looking though. It's probably my favorite architecture in the world is uh, the Asian, you know, architecture, buildings and whatnot. So, all right, well, I guess we're going to have to end it right here. But it leaves everybody waiting for the next episode. It's going to be exciting. We got a lot to do. We got a boss to fight. We got, hopefully, we get to do that mission if the mission's still available when we come back. All right. Well, if you uh, like to become part of the Meerkat Nation, hit that subscribe button. Join today. I'd love to get, see those numbers grow. It's been stuck at a low numbers for quite some time. Maybe, maybe nobody likes me. Nobody wants to be my friend. But yeah, um, if you have, so hit that subscribe button, join up, so you don't miss out on these awesome adventures. And, if you like my commentary, you find it helpful, funny, or entertaining, hit that like button to show you support. Help out my channel. And if you didn't, still hit that like button, because I'm still learning. And it's always a learning process every day, but I am getting better. Except when I'm sick. 
And next to that subscribe button, you'll see a bell icon appear. When you hit that bell icon, you'll be caught, become part of the Meerkat Nation notification squad. And when you're part of that squad, you don't miss all these adventures. So you'll be notified of all these awesome adventures if YouTube allows it. Because YouTube and their notifications lately has been kind of trash. But hopefully it works for you guys. Alright, well, I'll see you guys later. Y'all have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.